I'm Vicki Hall with Denver Home Finder Service and today I want to talk to you about who pays the buyer's agent. One of the first questions I get when I start working with a new buyer is how much do I charge? The wonderful thing about being a buyer is that you get an expert agent to guide you through the contracts, twists, turns, and negotiations and 99% of the time it doesn't cost you anything. That's pretty incredible. Then you might wonder, how do I get paid? Well, the seller pays me to represent the buyer. I know that sounds strange, but that's the way it works. It's a great thing when you're a buyer, but when you're the seller, it's not quite so great. Now, the reason it is only 99% of the time that buyer's agents get paid by the seller is because sometimes there are FSBOs. FSBO means for sale by owner, and that means that no realtor is involved in listing the home for sale. Most for sale by owners will co-op with the buyer's agent, meaning they will pay the buyer's agent fee. Occasionally we'll run into someone that has had a bad experience with realtors and doesn't want any realtor involved in a transaction. In that rare case, then you, the buyer, are responsible for paying the buyer's agent. But because of the realtor's experience in navigating through the process, they can frequently save you from very expensive mistakes that makes their commission very cost effective. And that's the story on who pays the buyer's agent. I'm Vicki Hall with DenverHomeFinderService.com.